Are you someone who is planning and preparing for Microsoft Azure Solution Architect certification? If yes, then watch this video very carefully as Microsoft has done some big changes the way you get this certificate. Missing on those changes can cost you very heavily. So come along with me and understand the changes in Microsoft Azure Solution Architect certification. Hello and welcome back to the Tech Blackboard. Today in this video, I will give you all the details that you need to know about Microsoft Azure Solution Architect Expert Certification. We will start the video by understanding what is the current certification path. Then after that, I will tell you what all changes are coming in the certification path. Following that, we will take what is the new path to Architect Expert Certification and then towards the last, I will explain you how does it impact to the existing architect expert certification. So watch the video till the very end. Now let's begin our video by understanding what is the current path of the certificate. Until now, the most popular certification path for Microsoft Solution Architect certification has been that you need to clear AZ303 and AZ304. Once you have cleared both these certification, then you finally get the Microsoft Azure Solution Architect certificate. This is an expert level certificate. You can see three stars here. And this is the final destination almost for everyone who is working as a solution architect in Azure Cloud. Moving ahead, now let's understand what are the changes that are coming in this current existing certification path. As we saw in the last slides, currently we have to pass both the AZ303 and AZ304 to get the Microsoft Azure Solution Architect certification. So what are the changes? The change is that both these certificates will not be valid and they are both retiring on 31st March 2022. So after 31st March 2022, neither you can give AZ303 or AZ304. So what is the new change? The new change is that Microsoft is launching a new certificate which is called AZ305. Now I understand that there are a lot of questions that will be popping in your mind. For example, what if that you have already done the AZ303? Or what if that you have already cleared both AZ303 and 304? Will your certificate will still be valid? Or is it that you have to start all over again and again do AZ305? Don't worry, every question will be answered and all your doubts will get clear as we move along in the video. So just stay with me. Before I answer all the questions, let's first understand what is the new path to Architect Expert Certification. In the new path for the certification, you have to now clear AZ104 or it is also known as Azure Administrator Associate. So this one is a two star certificate. And then in addition to this certificate, you have to also clear the newly launched certification, which is called AZ305. Once you have done both of them, then you will get your certificate for Microsoft Azure Solution Architect. So now let's understand how this change in the new certification path will impact your existing certificate. If you have already done 303 or 304, how does this change exactly impact you? Now, as we understood in the last slides, we know that now you have to clear AZ104 and then you have to clear AZ305. And then basically you get the certificate which is called Azure Solution Architect. Now to answer the question that what happens if you have already done AZ303 or AZ304. Just a quick note here, a star here in these AZ303 and 304 denotes that both are retiring on March 31st, 2022. So now let's suppose that you have already cleared AZ303 before 31st March. What happens now? So now instead of doing 304, you should opt for AZ305. Your 303 certificate will still be valid. And in addition to 303, you now also have to clear 305. 
Now let's suppose that you have cleared both 303 and 304 before March 31st, 2022. What happens then? So friends, in that case, you don't have to worry. Your certificate, which you have gained as Microsoft Solution Architect, that certificate is still valid. It's not going to expire if you have chosen the path of 303 or 304. However, if you are planning for 303 or 304, but you have not cleared it, then my strong recommendation is that you switch the path and now you should prepare for AZ-104 and AZ-305. For the better understanding, let me show you Microsoft site as well, where you can read all these changes in great detail. This is the Microsoft site where you can read in great detail about all the changes that are coming in the certification path for Microsoft Azure Solutions Architect Expert. On the very top of this page, you can read there is a warning symbol that says that exam AZ-303 and exam AZ-304 will retire on March 31st, 2022. And a new exam, exam AZ-305 is available. Just a little scroll and you will be reaching to this section where it is marked as important. And here it is given that to earn this certification, complete the following requirements. And as we understood in the video previously, that now you have to do either Azure Administrator Associate, and this is nothing but AZ-104, and then you have to pass AZ-305. Or, mind it, this is a or, my friends, you have to pass AZ-303 or AZ-304 before 31st March 2022. Or in case you have already passed AZ-303, then in addition to that, you have to now also clear AZ-305. I will give the link of this page in the description box below. I hope that all of you aspiring Azure Solution Architect would benefit from this quick update. If you still have any doubt or question, put them in the comment section below and I will make sure to answer each of them. One quick update that friends, after the great success of our fundamental series on AZ-900 and DP-900, I'm going to launch a new series on AZ-104 to help you prepare for the Microsoft Azure Solution Architect certification. So if you have not subscribed to the channel, do it now so that you are not missing on this upcoming exciting series on AZ-104. Also, please encourage me by hitting that like button. Each like from your side boosts my enthusiasm to create more quality content. We will see each other in the next video. Till then, stay fit, keep learning and thanks for watching.